Because of the current logistical situation, Threads of Fate is kind of hard to record at times, at many various times actually, and so I need something on the side that's easy to record, and I will be doing Threads of Fate as possible, but for now I've been wanting to get back to Super Mario Bros. X, and there's this game that I've been looking at that I've been waiting for a release date on, and come to find out it's actually been out for probably a few months or maybe even a year or so, I think. And that game is Return to Dinosaur Land by Valtteri. One of the... What the hell are you doing, Link? <laughs> wow. Yeah, that game is Return to Dinosaur Land by Valtteri, one of the original uber geniuses uh, behind a lot of the custom stuff in the original vanilla Super Mario Bros. X. Oh, alas, poor Star Scavenger. Oh, taking a second to mourn you. But we're going to be playing Return to Dinosaur Land. Ignore some of this other stuff. It's stuff I've either been playing for fun or been trying in vain to make whatever, just being stupid. But yeah, we're going to play the Mario game of Return to Dinosaur Land. As is my understanding, it's basically uh, Super Mario World 1.5. It takes place on in Dinosaur Land on Dinosaur Island. Same same worlds as Super Mario World. It's just kind of a bit of a remix, as is my understanding. Uh, there are some uh, there are some uh, pre pre included slots, but we're gonna go with the empty one from the beginning for maximum surprise potential. What's going on here? What's going on here? Do I get to ride you, Yoshi? No, of course not. That would be fun. Oh, usually the berries act like coins in Super Mario Brothers X. What's the big deal? Ow! Yeah, that's kind of Bowser's M.O., unfortunately. Bowser came back to Dinosaur Land again. Looks like Bowser is at it again. We need the eggs back before they hatch. Why before they hatch? If they hatch, they can turn into super killing machines, and that would be great. Ice Cream Island. That is the one new area in Return to Dinosaur Land. It comes after Chocolate Island. Just kind of to round things out, I guess. Oh, no, that's no good. Where did they get the money for that? Well, I guess they can collect coins, too. They never show it, but I guess they can. Okay, well, I guess so. As long as as long as long I'm here, I guess I'll rescue your eggs for you. Looks like we got, we got the Adventure Begins and Grassy Stage. It would make a lot of sense to go to the Adventure Begins, which is why I'm not going to do it. Let's go ahead and uh, go to the Grassy Stage. A two exit level, introducing them pretty early in the game. But hey, if you're familiar with Super Mario World, you know what's up. So, all right, yeah, we're going to get a lot of just plain old Super Mario World graphics. Not a lot in the way of remixing and custom stuffs going on here. Going to go ahead and pop onto him. I guess I'll try to get Dragon Coins where possible. I don't, I don't see the harm in it. There we go. Get out of here, kid. You bother me. All right, let's see what's going on then. Anything I can go inside? Can I sneak by one of you, one of you fine folks? Yeah, I guess it's pretty easy to make a game like this when you're only using vanilla graphics. A lot of the stuff I make uses custom graphics, and it takes me forever and a flipping day. All right, what have we got going on here then? Another dragon coin, hooray! Yeah, this is we're already at the third dragon coin, so we're definitely getting to a you know typical Super Mario World level length. I can tell. You know, that kind of easy intro, ease you in, can be beaten in about a minute or so, if possible, kind of groove. And I'm loving it. Okay, it's it's good so far. It's good so far. This is, well, this is a, this is an exercise in tediousness, though. Let's just get out of, let's get the hell out of here and probably decide not to do that. But yeah, this game, I thought this game was in, I thought this game was in beta. Oh, this is the same thing. Okay. I thought this game was in beta for the longest time. I was following this thread on a forum that I didn't realize for about eight months or so was locked. And it turns out the real game, I think this is the full game anyway, it turns out the full game has already been out and available for download. Because silly me, I read locked forum threads. That must be our secret exit right there. So, hello, star. Hit me with it. Okay, let's explore what does the Star World have to offer. Is it just is it just what they do in usual SMBX games where you just it's a warp zone and Oh, nice. I like that uh I like that mu Oh, hey, we've got we've got doors to unlock. What what's going on with these doors? 
What kind of... Five stars. That's not terribly... Three stars to enter. Wow, that's... I need four stars to enter there. Ah, yes, but it's probably going to be parceled out to, like, one star per... Okay, yes. One, two, three, four, all that. Ha ha, etc. Okay, so what's in door number one? Uh, I can have a Yoshi if I so choose. That's excellent. What a pretty picture up on the wall. Nice. Hello. Oh, hey! All right, awesome. Wow, yes, please. All right, already starting off good that way. Okay, so if I go to... Say, for example, World 2, uh, will it open up and let me play it, or am I just going to be stuck on a big dumb star thing? Yeah, I'm just stuck on a big dumb star thing. Let's go back to World 1, then. Let's go back to World 1 and uh, get back to normal exitry. Dinner, my boy. Okay, so where do we go from here? How, how much level do we have left from this point? Oh wow, that looks that looks a tad that looks a tad risky boots. Ha <laughs> ha! There we go. All right, not too much farther from there. We got little freezes whenever we do pivotal things like get one ups and hit end of level markers, but that's okay. All right, that familiar intro, and that leads us to the yellow switch hut. I mean, yellow Yoshi's house. Well, that makes sense, I guess. Right. Oh, hey, hello, yummies, hello, yummies. All right, let's 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 get it on one. Hey, Yellow Yoshi. Whoa, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't cave to peer pressure like that. Whoa. Also, I don't really need to be explained to what a mushroom does. Wow, I've never seen a fan game capture that level of Nintendo hand-holding tutorializing. That's kind of crazy. Let's go with The Adventure Begins, then. Let's... Let's begin our berry-eating constipation adventure. Let's eat, 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 Yoshi, eat. You need to eat and be healthy. Eat and be merry, my friend, for tomorrow we die and come back to life. All right, a flower in reserve. That's what I like to hear. Ah, the greedy cha-ching of the dragon coin. That's also what I like to hear. Let's pop up and up and up. Anything inside the little nook here? I didn't think so, but... Never hurts to check. It, it never hurts to help. Let's go up, because that is the only way to go. And then, hmm, this is ah, I'm I'm liking the I'm liking the feel of it so far. It's very it's very, you know, it's kind of got that general world one two feel to it. And so like one two one two one two, yeah, there we go. Are we gonna? Ooh, nice bendy pipe. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot better than the pipe joints that I normally use. But I don't normally use the Super Mario World pipes in my own excavationing. Let's go ahead. Oh, hey, that was complicated. Not a lot of green around here. A lot of a uh, lot of easy flora and fauna. There we go. Let's. Can we? Uh, do we actually get to continue? Oh, it would actually continue going on that way if I so chose. If I wanted to get it like a one-up or something. Okay, yeah, that's probably for the best. Anything I can go in here? It wouldn't appear so. It appears that this is the kind of game where when you can go in a pipe, it actually looks like it's leading to somewhere. Let's... Well, it doesn't look like I have a whole lot of choice here. Let's hit it. Let's go up the P-Switch staircase, my friends. Whoa, that was hard. Lots of timing involved. Holy crap. Okay, what's... Oh, wow, that... That turned funky. Okay, but whatever. I'm not one to judge. I'm not one to judge funky. Th oh, that's a that's a switch. It should notify me if the switch has been turned on. And oh, that's a nice little uh, that's a nice little reminder there. That's really cool. Okay, I dig it. And I could always go back if I wanted, but why would I do that? I just want to collect coins for one ups. Make big money at home, sharpen saws, and earn extra cash is what I want to do. Okay, and... Oh, hey, 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 hey. It looked like there was a thing down there, maybe. No, no, I can't start getting in that mode already. I cannot start getting in Donkey Kong Country mode. Just barreling down every pit that strikes my fancy. I can't do it. It can't be done. That way lies madness. I'm not going to do it unless it just absolutely... Unless I just absolutely feel stumped by trying to find something. It would not appear that there's anything of that nature in this level. Because I've already collected the star in this world. So it's probably just 
it's probably just death pits from here on out. So I'm not I'm not gonna get I'm not even gonna get involved in that kind of madness. Not today, no sir. Let's go again up. This is very there's a lot of height here. All things. Oh, hey, 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 hey! It's actually it actually works like a yellow switch palace. Normally the switch blocks do not work like that in SMBX. You don't get mushrooms out of them and stuff. And up to the one-up coin. There we go. And I feel very unsafe just blind dropping. Not blind playing because this game seems like it's going to be really, really easy. Uh, which is which is something SMBX games have trouble airing on the side of is too easy, too hard, you know. Because you can't you can't save state like you can with an emulator, so it's all just it's all just in good fun here. You're just playing for fun, so striking a difficulty balance uh, is something that is not always easy from time to time in the SMBX engine created by Redigit and discontinued and had fun with. By other people currently. Hey, yeah, let's let's loop around here. That wasn't well. I guess I could have. Well, no, I don't know. Wait, 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 wait. What's going on here? What's what's the big idea? What's the big idea with the spring? Is it just to give me a boost to the? Is it just to give me a boost up to? Am I actually supposed to jump on it, or is it supposed to help me get a one up at the end of the level? I am not... Oh, I'm at the top of the level, basically. Uh... I think it's just to help me get a boost for this thing, but I don't really think I need to do that. I think I could just... I... <laughs> well, that was clever and cute, but I... I... Hmm. Oh, well, whatever. I'm not too concerned about getting one-ups from the goalpost. That's not... That's not what we're here for. We are sort of here. There's Ice Cream Island over there. The, uh... The cyan colored type of deal that's world seven over there we can already see world seven over here from here doing the sightseeing seeing the sights having the fun attacking the porky puffers porky puffers getting really wow getting a little bit intense this certainly whoa you're not supposed to be able to do that what is your glitch numb nuts oh hmm oh hey hello that probably just leads to a dragon coin or something, knowing the gen- Yeah, <laughs> I've already, already got the feel for this game. Anything on top of the pole here? No. Man, I feel like a fancy person for being able to do that. Should have made me be able to do that. Okay, so what's going on now? You're gonna, you're gonna pop up out of the ground. Wow, you guys are, you guys are scary. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so. But yeah, this, this game is definitely kind of following the general mode of Super Mario World so far. The level progression has been about the same. Although, uh, there... Uh, whoa, 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 whoa! That's what we need in our lives is projectile jumping cheap cheeps. So let's keep a steady stream of... Let's keep a steady stream of death flowing from our hands here. And I think we can go into... I think we can venture into the water here. That's probably not the best thing for our health, but actually it's the best thing to stay in the water, actually. That's that seems to be what's helping. Okay, let's go in. Let's go in the pipe and see what we can get here. That is some pretty seaweed actually. It looks very <laughs> actually it looks kind of Commander Keen esque. I can see how it was recolored for Super Mario World, but it has kind of a kind of a Commander Keen flat color-esque affectation to it. It's it's cute. I like it. Don't get me wrong. It's cute. I like it way mucho. Okay, yes, we don't want to get back into... Yeah, we don't want to get back into that kind of territory. Okay, see, this is Porky Puffer behavior that I'm used to right here. This is... This is more in line with something that I would say makes some degree of sense. Okay, and yet another... Yet another P-Run. Except I can't be, uh, I can't be cautious this time. I gotta run it. I gotta run. Oh, hey. Wow, I'm getting lucky with the fireballs here. That's, I do not want to land in the water. That's, whoa, 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 So would I have been able to, oh, now I can't get the last dragon coin, though. That makes me, oh, that makes me a sad face. But at least I got on top. At least Mario went out on top there. Let's, okay, let's. Let's count our blessings, why don't we? Let's be thankful. Let's be thankful for all that we have. Okay, so up. I'm going to pop your face off. All of you, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. You're going to kill you dead. 
This is a this is actually kind of a scary level for World One. This is okay. Maybe this game isn't going to be so easy if it's gonna if it's gonna pull off tricks like this. Oh, jumping Porky Puffer. Oh, this is a scary level. Oh, hey, oh, yeah, 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 hey, 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 I like that a lot. What's going on? Hey, all right, they actually. Oh no, that's not an extra dragon coin. I thought I had gotten four already. Dang, Nabbit, that silly, that silly, uh. That silly two dragon coin area over there made me think things earlier. Oh, you made me think, Booger. Pop. Let's pop into the exit. Do we have time for the castle? I f would feel a little weird beating World 1 today, but it only seems right and proper, actually. Only seems like the right thing to do. So let's go ahead. Larry's Generic Castle, which they sell at the dollar store. This place is actually inflatable, it turns out. Okay, what's what's the deal here? Well, yeah, that's pretty much in line with regular Super Mario World reasoning. Oh, well, poop. Okay, I guess that's not so bad. I'm going to wait for you to blow fire before I move on, because now, thanks to Porky Puffer, I'm literally afraid of everything. Okay, that's that's actually different. That was actually worth noting, so thank you, thank you for the NB there, game. There we go. Now, do I continue to get... Do I continue to get... Oh, 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 wow. I almost forgot the warning already. No, I don't guess I can... Uh, I don't guess I can stack it up for one-ups. That's unfortunate. Okay, I'm gonna have to... There we go. That wasn't so bad. All right. Already enforcing the spin jumping, too, I see. That's... That's certainly something. And I cannot fire I cannot fire fireballs while on the fence. That's also something slightly different than the norm. Okay, yeah, but I'm that that's that's not difficult to get used to. That's just that's just a fluke of Mario X. That's just the way it was kind of coded in a drunken stupor one night over burritos and beer. Let's <laughs> Okay, now, now, now the stakes are actually, the stakes are actually going up a little. This is, this is legitimately scary now. I am, you have made me afraid. Is that what you were going for? You, hell no, I'm not getting that dragon coin. That is way too risky for a man of means such as myself. I have too much on the line here. I'm going through the door to success land. Oh, the ice flower, the all, the almighty, all-knowing ice flower. Got to be careful though. Ooh, I like the I like the ice effect there. Very purdy. Okay, so you you purdy boy. And okay, yeah, that's probably gonna be the last of those that I get. Unless that one was a decoy and you're not intended to get it in any way for any reason. I probably could have just hung off the fence, but it looked a little bit too. Oh, really? Really? You're gonna do this to me? You're going to let me not enjoy the benefits of my ice flower for five seconds. You're going to not really penalize me. Oh, okay, yes, I can't. That one was, I guess. That was a trap sort of deal, I guess. Okay, quit bouncing over, guys. What? I, uh, the ice flower is kind of funky sometimes, the way it bounces. But I guess it's no funkier than the fire flower. Jump on Larry when he's on the edge of the platform. He will eventually fall after some tries. Uh, okay. Why would why would Larry himself have a thing that tells me that? Why is Larry... I assume Larry was not responsible for the installation of the instruction manual in his own castle. That was probably something he didn't even order. Probably paid for it, but he didn't order it. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, pop you off. Pop off. Pop off, sir! Okay, I cannot ice fire you. That would make too much sense. Let's. Okay, you are you are kind of hard to get off the edge of your own platform. Uh, how about no? How about yeah? I was gonna say how about now, but how about now? What about now? Okay, how there we go. Perfect. Oh, there was just ground floor underneath here the whole time. It was probably just fake lava the whole time. Ha ha ha! Or not. Let's just go through the door that's oddly positioned on the platform and see what's outside. How about... Do I get to crack you open? That is not the kind of egg I get to crack open, I don't think. 
No, I cannot crack that egg open. It's just something I can toss around. Can I go back through the door? I don't want to save the eggs. I don't want to be responsible for that. Donut Plains, where you'll discover the Super Leaf that lets you fly around. Again, totally in line with the progression of the first game. Yeah, we're pretty much getting Super Mario World 1.5 here. It's going to be a blast. Join me as we move on into World 2 in Episode 2. Okay, so the egg is not intended to hatch yet. We have to save the eggs before they hatch, but I cannot enforce hatching. I see. I get it. Well, see you later, Yoshi. You seem pretty happy, and your mouth is full of blood. So let's move on to Donut Plains, where I will see you guys next time. Moving across, ah, good old bridge. Back to carry me from World 1 to World 2. Except without the fun iris in, iris out that moves really quickly. Ah, there's just some touches that Mario X can't do that you get a little wistful for. Oh well, let's, what's the point that activates the Yoshi Island music? Okay, I actually have to get over onto the island. That's interesting. Okay, so, here we go. Okay, Donut Plains next time, and it makes sense that this is a red level. Because the first level of Donut Plains was the first red level in Super Mario World. Although it's not the first red level here, because we're not dummies. We know what we're doing. I mean, come on. <laughs>